Alright, so on the last episode, we did Hold'em 2, and I had made plans to go to Parasite, as I believe that was one of the other difficult ones that people were having some trouble with, but we shall see for ourselves. Let's play. Ah, I see why there's a tr why there's a problem here. Oh, okay. Uh, so this parasite is all creeper reader terrain. That's great. I mean, fortunately we have a decent outpost, but that is going to be a nuisance map. If I've learned anything about reader terrain is that it's annoying. It is at three, so it's half of half of the effectiveness. But of course, it's covering this entire thing. Mint mode is at 9.0, so that's been edited to be three times as much. We have holes in our walls apparently as well. That's kind of unideal. So I guess we have to. Hmm. Yeah, we don't have any available urns, so this is kind of spooky. Um, Creeper is already getting sent into the stash, and I suppose there's some starting points here. Oh, we also have to deal with Crimson, and Blobs and Spores. Fortunately, no Skimmers. Okay, well... Let's get started and see how this goes. <laughs> I'm not looking forward to this one bit. <laughs> I'll just build a turp then. Oh no. Yeah, that's gonna get ridiculous real quick. The idea is to use up most of the energy, but still be able to double build. Wow, this is gonna this is gonna be a long one, I'm pretty sure, so let's not even try and pause here. The turp gets right on it. Let's get our first miner. Also earn that first miner. Okay, so we're going to have some issues with this. So let's build... actually let's hold off on that. Let's hold off on that because I know we're already in a deficit. We don't need to be in an even bigger deficit right now. Uh, we have three more urns that we can use. So I have a rough idea that it's going to be attack range. Attack rate and more than likely energy collection. Uh, we do get a decent amount of blue eye here. Is this mine almost done? Please. <laughs> we need a we need a move. We also need to move this turp. Let's move it this way first. We can build two sprayers. Put them always on. What do they need? Arg. We need arg. So we need a factory, that's kind of important. We're getting sprayers without a factory. That's, oh, that's probably a little bit off, yeah. Okay. Makes sense. Anyway. I guess first things first, we're gonna turn off the supply on all these totems. Supply this one first. Let us just supply the ones that have the holes in the walls first, actually, because I don't think the turp will be able to get those covered in time. Uh, just a hunch. Just a hunch. Let's do energy connection collection. Why can I... Oh, I see. So this has been changed recently. I guess this is the version 1.1.0, one of the changes there. Uh, so we can pre-allocate urns now and then the urn portal's building, that's nice. Kinda threw me for a loop there. 
that's not used to that. Also get a turp for each hole, and also change it so that it's not a hole anymore. Let's see, I don't know. So we need four. We have four, three building. Okay. So fire range, preferably any mortars everywhere. So that's that's the kind of map we're dealing with currently. Uh, this is not the most ideal placement. Uh, I'm, pa I'm pausing for no reason again. We're not under any imminent threat yet. Pushing into the parasite, that's uh, yeah. It's, uh, that's gonna be another issue. So, this is our first objective. Uh, let's do transparent creep. Probably get the legs. I don't know. That's tough. It's tough to say. So let's get fiery. Put them as closest. Put those um, towers as closest as close to the holes in the ore deposit as possible. Okay, we have blobs and not skimmers, but spores. Coming soon. Okay, I don't know why. Why am I lost right now? <laughs> okay. Let's get that ready. Don't understand. There's nothing to be lost about here because this is a easy start, but it is a well. It's going to be a very Long map. Make sure that mortar goes there and gets rid of that creeper before we activate the shields. Oh, it's getting past. That is not good. But then again, I guess we're expecting that because it's coming from the main source. This, this whole thing is a go back thing. Because we didn't activate the shields. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, you know. I want a missiles. You know, that's, that's partly my fault. <laughs> uh, I just need to supply this. Should be covered in the back though. We have to waver these shields to activate now. I'm also gonna need a pylon. That work. Thanks. Okay. Speaking of no eminent threat, of course, when you don't get the totems up in time, that's kind of a problem, isn't it? I should have prioritized the right side first instead of the bottom, but okay. You live and you learn. Let's breed your terrain. Should be turning off soon anyway. At least that's the hope. The expectation. And the eggs. Yeah, the eggs are gonna be coming now. Which I suppose will not allow us to cap off the creep. The creeper here? That is a large stash. Okay. 
mean, that's not going to be doing anything soon, but... <laughs> oh, what is happening? Really? Alright, that's just bogus. I mean, come on. What is that? Ah, come on, man. Okay, let's just accelerate these mortar placements. Pressing the wrong keys again. Do we want this to not be earned right now? No, we want it earned still. Let's just put this back here. Supply those now so that no more eggs come from across the battlefield. We have a totem there just to make sure that we <laughs> don't win instantly. Alright. It's good to see. That, I mean, that little bit of creeper is still there, apparently. It's that little area in the shield that it can be in. Yeah, we are running quite low on Argon. But we did just power up all the totems here. Well, okay. Let's finish the rest of this as much as we can. Uh, that's not the most efficient I've ever seen, but hey, okay. I'll suffice for now. And let's get to expanding. Uh, let's also take our anti-creeper here. So change two of these to blue white so that we have enough to provide ammo for the two sprayers. That is still there. I do not like that still being there. Let's get rid of it so I can place some order there finally. <laughs> so everything seems to be better off now. I still have some creeper on this ledge. Yeah, the snipers here aren't going to be doing anything, so the blobs can actually get those mortars easily. Just move the cannon up. Okay, that's fine. Move the cannon down, put some snipers. If we can just suppress it enough, it'll be good to go. We definitely need a lot more weaponry, though. Uh, this could be a... Well, I could make a... Runway and some bombers, but... Yeah. Okay, that just cursed, then. Alright. That's fun. Some gaps in the holes. I mean, I guess we just need more mortars and maybe a cannon there. I could try. Okay, no blobs did anything there. Let's move that mortar so that we can get a pile on there. Of course, the first objective is to clear this breeder terrain, contain it for the time being, and make sure it doesn't ever become a threat again, ever. Fortunately, it seems like a mint mode off is just not gonna be a thing. Well, I mean, there's something just... I mean, it's periodically going off and on because of the intervals of the breeder terrain. That's somewhat inconsistent due to the fact that there are no emitters on the map. If there were emitters, then the breeder train wouldn't be as effective. Suppose we need more cannons. More than likely need 
at least like two snipers. Throw one now. Throw one there and build another one. So let's just get this surrounded with cannons, of course. So as we know, cannons usually the first line of defense, but since we're getting the waves from those stashes, it's gonna be quite the annoyance. Let's also make sure there's two more mortars there, because that looks like it's close to breaking. Yeah, sometimes just overflows, but there's a cannon there. Just make sure it doesn't overflow as much. That's, that's that area again. The creeper can just get up. Uh, I'm not even gonna put the cannon there because the cannon's just gonna die. Maybe. I mean, sometimes they, the cannons sometimes just can't just can't just shoot down. It's like creeper touching the wall, and of course the cannon can't kill the creeper touching the wall. And so that way the creeper was able to do damage to the cannon without the cannon being able to shoot at it ever. At least that's, that's what happens in my experience. I've also had units just randomly die and no creeper be by them whatsoever, but I don't know. I think that's just my <laughs> that's just more of an issue of playing too long and stuff just starts to not render or something along those lines. I, I haven't really tested what the issue was. Personally, which is why I haven't reported it myself. But when I'll see it again, maybe I'll show it off. Could be fixed for all I know. How's our energy? We're at 30. Yeah, we can definitely uh, say that much. Expansion. Just try and expand with as much mortars as possible. Of course, spores are trying to get to that breeder terrain. Let's just put one can in there. <laughs> Assuming the spore is unedited. Hopefully. <laughs> Hopefully that's not a surprise. Let's get a micro rift at home base. Soon we're gonna need that blob. Oh no. Did not get the blob because our snipers haven't really moved up at all. We can just rebuild that sprayer, it's fine. Let's just get another perimeter of snipers up then. Okay, ah, I'm sure that's fine. I'm, I'm sure nothing could possibly go wrong there, right? I mean, we've got a decent pocket of AC in that area. What could go wrong? Well, at our next objective is more than likely just um, probably getting that stash and into that. Oops. Well, maybe getting the totem because that's the first objective we can get. I may as well go for it. Yeah, this is going to start to get messy, so I'm going to have to start uh, selecting all of just uh, mousing over them. Sometimes, I mean, usually I click them, but the amount of creeper this map is emitting, I have to move them in squads, or sort of squads, because, I don't know, if I do the squads thing, then it might become an issue that they start placing in ways I don't want them to place. Maybe. Again, I still haven't used the squad functionality at all. Uh, blobs are gonna kill some of my units again. That was on the cliff. Too 
bad. I would love to put a sniper there, but there's just creepers sometimes that just sneaks up. Okay. Try and advance slowly but surely. In a timely fashion, because we don't want to be here all day. <laughs> and get a third spray now. I mean, this is the lengths you have to go to sometimes. Gotta make sure we can push forward without any uh, hiccups. Once we start running into hiccups, that's when issues start occurring. Now, of course, we are going to be running into that shortly when we get to the breeder terrain. Because the more we clear, the more it emits, and... Yeah. Maybe we should go towards the top right area, but... That seems like the final thread if we get through the whole parasite. And then it won't really be a threat at that point, but it'll be emitting at full power for sure. Okay, that micro rip is going down now. Let's hope the missile coverage is good enough. Well, I should be able to cover that last four though. Nice. Some of these dilemmas here. <laughs> Gets quite tedious. I mean, the method I'm using is, it's alright. It'll suffice. But I have to really improve on the squad control here. Uh, we're on... Uh, I guess I'll make another sprayer because we're at max, pretty much. I don't want to be wasting that. Can get more, we will get more. Like, I could get more, I could get like double the amount, but then more moving nonsense. There's the cannon in the back, I don't know. Hmm. I am missing a few units though, so this isn't 100% effective. Also, accidentally cl clicking the towers. I'm gonna get some kills again because I didn't move up the snipers at all. I'm gonna stop that. I don't know why that's there. Yeah. Sprayer, sprayer. And something else. Just two sprayers? Okay. Stash before it comes out, which I believe just 
permits the creeper that's in it and doesn't multiply it, but I could be wrong. Alright, so we're getting a leg of the <laughs> parasite. That creeper, that, that crimson terrain is gonna be fun. Let's also try and grab some of the mortars in the back here. And we're gonna need more cannons. Some of those are just gonna uh, yeah, evaporate. So we'll just build a bunch more. Blobs, of course, snipers are not in position. It's too bad. <laughs> it's too bad, I don't know. I could constantly move these or I could just build more and more every time I move up. Could just prioritize just moving them forward instead of letting the blobs kill my units three at a time. But yeah, so here comes the problem where the mint mode is less than what it's supposed to be when it's off. Yeah, and maybe, maybe that top right section is a priority instead of the parasite, but like. The issue here is that this is, I don't know, how high is this? It's 9 versus 1, yeah. There's a stash in the back, bottom right as well. We don't need to worry about it because that's not something we can nullify, but it's going to be a problem. Not as much as the breeder terrain because that's the main issue. It's the main point of the map. So let's not forget to move our snipers. I'm gonna do some egg popping. Oh, those payloads are different. <laughs> okay. I look at about 20 or so high. Maybe that's what they want us to do. They want us to put cannons on there. I don't know. How are we gonna deny this? Do we turp it down, maybe? Seems like a lot of work. But, I mean, if you have to get the job done that way, maybe you do. Maybe you don't. Just get that. Uh, let's get that totem ready. Took quite a while to get there, even. That is pretty far away. Missile coverage is not good again. Yeah, just a gradual advance now. We can't really do much here. Just wait. Just wait and advance slowly. stop the X from ever advancing. Unless it's to the blob nest or the spore launcher, which I mean that's already been happening. Mm -hmm. I guess we can start switching this the switches to blue eye instead. Actually that's not even that gray. <laughs> um let's do this and put that on mine production instead. That way we can get a lot more anti-creeper sprayers. Maybe that's what we need for denial here. We shall see if that works. Getting even more red on, so frivolously just put my curves down. So 
hope that gets denied. I mean, I suppose this is the strategy to deny this. To secure this, that is. Yeah. It doesn't seem too effective because Creeper can still get on top of it, but. You gotta, you gotta use what you can. This totem, why is this totem not getting powered? Oh, it's cut off, right? I controlled eight off all those, yeah. That makes sense. That's my error, it's not even the game's fault. So who knew I would get this far, right? <laughs> Alright, I mean... Ba -ba 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 -ba. I just didn't want to deny the crimson here. This might be excessive though. That's enough. We have enough. Where's the crimson? Ah, <laughs> oh, it's right there. Duh. Okay. Just want to deny the crimson so we don't have to deal with that. Probably should get some AC bombers. Maybe. We have four more sprayers available. This is just a mess. <laughs> Such a mess. It's not getting any cleaner either. Just gotta put some more mortars down, I think. Though we're at an energy crisis now. No more. <laughs> how you solve it, right? You make more energy. Now, those bombers are taking quite the amount of energy. Nice. That's crazy. I did not expect that to be that much energy, but I mean, when they're all getting their ammo at the same time, of course it is. It doesn't, I mean, it seems like we're getting our ammo still. I don't know. Could be the anti creeper just carrying us now. No, we don't have that much anti creeper. So. But it was it really? I don't know. So keep moving forward. That's probably too close to the sun. Well, we we got it down in seven point six, but we are now facing crimson. Saves, but okay, the bombers are going out. Our deficit is at 80. Uh, hmm. well, I hardly use bombers, but this is one of those times where I would really like to have them. Even if it is not gonna do much, but I, I trust in them. It's getting quite a bit, even with the Crimson active. It's not getting that intended effect that I wanted. Hmm. Maybe, let's say... Nope. Save to that stash instead. Oh, well, I mean, it did a, it did a really good job. Oh, the 
blobs, oh no. <laughs> uh, we didn't lose anything, okay. I mean, I didn't move up the sniper, so I was expecting uh, three losses there, but I didn't lose anything instead. Point eight. Bombers are doing very good, I guess. Look at that. That line. Nicely done, nicely done. Okay, maybe I do want them on the Crimson Pylon. I mean, I'll reduce the amount of Crimson Creeper I have to deal with. Yeah, there it is, another order. Another one. It's just that issue of. Um, well, we can't really attack it right now, but I suppose the bombers can help line our load, despite being very energy costly. I mean, hitting peaks of like 160 energy usage, just causing an 80 deficit. It's uh, quite a bit. Well, we're like barely halfway through as well. <laughs> Actually, I think we've just crossed the halfway. Halfway through the map. <laughs> More than halfway through the map, but of course that's not halfway through the creeper terrain. Oh dang, look at that. Oh wow, it did have that intended effect, nice. Well done, well done indeed. And blobs just ruin it. <laughs> blobs just ruin the day again, man. Oh well. I uh, don't know. It's a lot of issues here. A cannon, a, a cannon and a mortar died, alright. I'll just double up on them then. The front lines. You know what, let's just push forward. Why not? Push forward through the middle instead of perimeter. Everything is connected. You want to see all those red wires. Our reclaim is charging up now. And it's going back down. And it's going back up, maybe. <laughs> yep, there he goes again. Get all of our anti creeper here. Let's focus on this. Bobs in 25 seconds, so. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't think we'll get there in time. Reclaim is done. Rift again. Oh, they're shooting the eggs. That's not. Mm. <sighs> yeah, okay. Thanks, snipers, for your participation. Pylon just completely powered up again, that's kind of annoying. Thank you, snipers. Let's just do that again, please. So without the eggs dying horrific de deaths on one fell swoop. 
Also, it's still like. Contain this, but still like the creeper on that terrain, fortunately. So, as soon as it starts spawning, it just starts spreading as well. Mm, that egg wave is looking bad, though. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. Just try and focus on the Why am I not surprised that some of these connections are not working now? Whoopsie. That's a problem. That is a massive problem. Hmm. Turrets there to replace that. <laughs> Maybe just more cannons, honestly. Get more cannons, we should be good to go. Okay. Blobs are soon to be nullified. Let's have the bombers focused on the Launcher. Oh no. They're landing their shots. Let's make sure that never happens again. You know, the spores are just not doing much. Don't know why. I don't know if you can edit the payload of spores, but so far I have not seen a menacing amount of spores. Strictly spores. Ah, where's the rest of this? Yeah, those eggs are what's gonna take a while here. <laughs> so there we go, there's that wave again. That wave nobody really wants to see. Uh, our nullifier is not here. And we have insufficient connections again. So let's make sure that's connected again. Micro Rift has been built, so we have faster packet transfer now. Trying to move mortars that aren't doing much. Um, cannons. Ooh, that egg almost got some stuff. Blobs are gonna go out, unfortunately. Lost a sprayer, but that seems to be about it. Still have 10 squads. We can get a 11th one now. So we are at max capacity, or max supply of anti creeper. Let's get these cannons in the front now. And from there, let's also put those guys there. Should be moved up now to deny any more spawn of creeper. Towers just to make sure everyone's getting ammo. Yeah, mint mode, we're at 1.2. 
That is very good. We'll just keep the bombers there and hope that they can help out the nullifier deploy. And that should be our last objective. So yeah, this breeder terrain just, you know, same thing with the stash, kind of threatening, but the real threat is just the creeper breeder terrain. <laughs> Yeah, I guess, I mean, if it was higher, okay, how did that happen? Sure thing. You know what, we'll just build multiple because, alright, that's how that happened. The eggs, the eggs are just spawning on top of the nullifiers now. Or something, they're just bouncing around. We're having a good time, ruining my day because, hey, they're eggs that decide to just bounce on your buildings when they come out. <laughs> yeah, just ridiculous. <laughs> I could just spray. I could pretty much just launch one up into the nullifier line if I'm just not lucky. Sure, which is why I've built multiple of them now. All right, well, that was Parasite, and, well, it does highlight the threat of the Creeper Breeder terrain when you use too much of it. <laughs> but, some, sometimes that does present a challenge. Anyways, let's rift jump out of here. I could, yeah, I mean, I can see why people have taken a lot of time here. Maybe they were contained earlier, or whatnot. What Don't know what their situations were. So I'm not gonna consider all of the possible situations. Alright, so. That was Parasite, and that is it today's episode. If you enjoyed and made it this far, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!